It's a common misconception that the switch on the bottom of a Carrera Digital 132 or D124 car is an analog to digital or digital analog switch. And if that were the case, then this switch would be in the digital position, having just proved it by running the car on my Carrera Digital track. If that's the case, then shouldn't the car go if I put it on in reverse? I mean, it should do something, but it doesn't. That's because it's actually a polarity switch. Now we're going to leave the switch in this position and go down to my Skelextric track, which is a Skelextric digital track with an analog functionality that I've wired into the, system, into the track. And as you can see, the switch on the car has not changed position. Still in that position. And now we're at my Skelextric track, which is currently set up for analog driving. If I put the car on the track, it makes sense that the car would not go. However, in reality, it's a polarity switch. And to put a Carrera digital car into analog mode, you have to put the car on a track with the correct polarity and then pull the trigger three times so that it gets power three different times. And then it says, oh, I'm on an analog track, I should go. So it's not getting that power with the correct polarity when I put my car on in the correct direction because of the polarity switch being in that position. Now, without changing the switch position, if I put the car on my track in reverse, which, which would therefore be opposite normal track polarity, and then pull the trigger, the car shouldn't go. If it's an analog digital switch, the car should stay put because it's still in digital mode. Oh, the car is going. That's because it's a polarity switch. And I can make the car go the correct way around my track by flipping the polarity switch. And if it were truly an analog digital switch and I merely put the car in analog mode by doing all those things and flipping the switch, then it should not go on my Carrera digital track, right? It's in analog mode switch position. So we'll go back to the Carrera digital track and see what happens. I put the car on the track in the normal direction. If it's an analog digital switch, or a polarity switch for that matter, the car won't go. But if it's a polarity switch, all I have to do is turn the car around and it'll go. If it's an analog digital switch, it's still in analog mode position, the car should not go. As you can see, the switch is a polarity switch. And the reason people believe that it's an analog digital switch is because the car won't go into analog mode until it has the power with the right polarity. And since Carrera digital tracks use opposite of normal analog track polarity, the car doesn't get that power until you flip that switch. So it makes perfect sense that people are confused by this, even people in Carrera and people who know very much about the system. But I don't know if there's any other way that I can show that it's a polarity switch than what I've just done. So hopefully that helps people gain a better understanding of what that switch actually does.